And all is set for the filing of Certificate of Candidacies for next year's elections. Now that the election fever is on, the Commission on Elections hopes tomorrow's start of filing of candidacies will run smoothly. Patricia Mangune with the report. Filing of Certificate of Candidacies for the 2019 elections begins tomorrow. The COMELEC has set a limit on the number of companions a candidate may tag along to the COMELEC main office. Four companions for a senatorial candidate and ten for party list nominees. Gimmicks will be allowed as long as they won't be an obstruction to pedestrians. We don't want to turn it into a circus of supporters. Meanwhile, the COC form this year features a new item which pertains to a question of whether a candidate has been held liable for an offense with a penalty of perpetual disqualification from holding public office. The COMELEC explains this is for transparency, which will also hasten the process of filtering disqualified candidates. You're looking at 18,000 elected positions, so more than 18,000. And for every elected position, you're looking at the minimum of two candidates, right? So that's a lot of people. If, can you imagine if the COMELEC had to, had to uh, conduct background checks, checks for all of those uh, within the short span of time that we have to process this? It'll make it easier for us to, to process the, uh, the COC to find out if this person actually is eligible to run for office. But former COMELEC Chairman Sixto Brillantes believes this new insertion into the COC is unnecessary. He fears it is forcing a candidate to incriminate himself. His suggestion, if the answer is yes, better not run for office at all. So, Sinachesco, if you're a candidate, don't answer yes. Because if you answer yes, you're already admitting or you are disqualifying yourself. No, it's okay, which means you don't have, you are not within the question. You have not committed any offense, you have, there's no accessory penalty, it is not yet final and executory. Marami. So no is the better answer, or should be the answer. But the Comelec argued ticking yes does not automatically mean a disqualification. It may mean a case has been decided upon, but eventually overturned. That is why a space for elaboration is provided for at the back of the COC form. So the candidate is protected. He is not, he's not going to be um, like sort of uh, tricked into admitting something he shouldn't admit. The thing is, um, of course, you want the candidates to be truthful. Mm -hmm. And, and this, this creates uh, the, that, that particular framework where the candidate has no choice but to be truthful. For News 5. Patricia Mangune, we are One News.